So in this uh, presentation, we'll learn how to do a urinalysis test. That is testing the urine for diff different compounds. In this case, testing for leukocytes, nitrites, blood, pH, proteins, ketones, and glucose. Different manufacturers have different uh, tests, uh, different order of the tests, different amount of tests. Uh, and so it's important to pay close attention as to what is written on the packaging. So what you do to do the test is you open the container. Container contains multiple strips. You just take one. Uh, make sure that you wear gloves because uh, you're dealing with body fluids. And what you do is you hold the little strip. You take the urine container and then you spill it as opposed to uh, putting it inside. That's the common mistake is to put it inside the urine. You have to realize that this urine is often sent for culture therefore if you dip it into the urine you actually con might, may contaminate the urine. So what you do is you drip it on it, you close the container tight and then you can read the test. As you see there's uh, different colors. Make sure that you hold it appropriately. The, uh, there is a, a drawing of a finger uh, as to where the uh, the end of which end to stick to to hold uh, in the ap appropriate way. We'll just turn it around here so we can actually read the different uh, uh, urine tests. I hope that you can see it appropriately. Um, and so what you do is you you compare the color of uh, what's on the stick uh, with the color that's on the container. Uh, realize that some might take 60 seconds and some might be a little bit quicker uh, to give you the result. We won't really go into the detail of how to read the result. Uh, you can just compare it to the guide, but this uh, gives you a good idea how to appropriately do a urinalysis test. Once you get the result, uh, you write down the, uh, the different parameters and you put it into the uh, computer and uh, that way you can let the doctor know what the result of the test was.